Hello and welcome back to something which should look a bit familiar to you guys and yeah um I'm back on GMine, well the temporary version of it anyway um pretty much you know we only have this old copy of it which why you can see that and my never portal's there um and yeah the person the or the company or whatever that was hosting our servers got hacked you know pretty much just a, that's pretty much the story and then yeah, the Geo who owns the server only has this old copy of the map uh, because the other's got corrupt or something. So yeah, I'm back on GMI. Um, no one's on at the moment because I don't know actually. I don't know if anyone's actually been on yet. Um, but yeah, as you can see, this is kind of an older version of my base. Like, there's chests everywhere. It's all a bit crazy, and I've not been doing very much. Um, we talked to Gio and he said something about maybe kind of doing the whole arc thing again where everyone put all their treasured, treasured possessions in a chest uh, on a boat and then that was kind of taken to the new world. don't know if that's going to happen, especially since I went through the nether, I thought, you know, the nether will still be there. No, nope, uh, the nether wasn't there. Um, I might go through there in a bit, but yeah, there was pretty much just a brand new nether, which is a bit weird. Um, wasn't expecting that. But yeah, this is kind of, kind of going back in time a bit, um, kind of missing a hell of a lot of things in my base. I've been kind of collecting some uh, valuables and stuff in these chests, just in case, you know, Gio uh, does decide to do the whole arc thing. If he doesn't, then, you know, start off, you know, completely fresh. But that's fine. Um, got my snow golem down there. Um, I've got my pumpkins back, which is amazing, because, you know, they're my favourite thing to have in my base. Um, <laughs> great. Um, yeah, so I don't really know what to say. This is kind of kind of going to be like a, I suppose kind of a goodbye, kind of a farewell video. Um, I'm not sure I'm naming this yet, but it's kind of something like that. Um, yeah, it's pretty much just me saying goodbye to this base and uh, hopefully starting a new one pretty soon, I hope. I don't know, I mean, Gia's going to have to do a lot of work and, you know, try and, you know, find a new host and everything. Uh, this is currently hosted, might be on his laptop again, I'm not sure, but, uh, yeah, look, I've got all these chests here, I've been trying to sort these out, there's just so much random stuff. Um, yeah, there's just random stuff that I probably don't need to take with me. Nah, not a load of rubbish, but, uh, yeah, I'm pretty much gonna maybe do kind of a little tour, I suppose, of, uh, of my base, as it kind of was... I think this copy is from October the 12th or something like that. So yeah, it's a bit of an old copy. I'm going to head down and, you know, look around and kind of, you know, maybe look back on things a little bit. Like these things here. Um, yeah, kind of now I don't really like these these little... I don't know, what, what were these for? I have no idea. Um, I'm going to have to look back at some episodes and think, you know go back and try and find out what, what I was actually thinking because this is a bit a bit weird. Um, yeah, it would have been quite nice to keep them all exactly the same and not have the water thing, but you know, apparently at the time I thought that was a good idea. Got my little enchanting table here, which I could have done something a bit fancier with, I mean, that still works as a torch that fell off, but uh, yeah, also got my little zombie, zombie farm, that should still work, yeah. Okay, and the hole's still in the middle there, so that was done before the October. Whatever. Um, we did have villagers here last episode, I think. And I was going to be doing stuff with them, but obviously they're not there. Leave that on as well. Um, what else have I got? My wheat farm. I'm going to miss that. I'm going to have to remake this or kind of. Maybe it's not a bit fancier. Oh, I'm going to. Oh, I'm going to miss this guy as well. It's Iron Golem. Bye! <laughs> He's like, yeah, he doesn't care. Um, oh, this isn't even grown. It's weird. Um, yeah, I'm gonna have to do something like this again. Maybe kind of. Hmm. I was gonna say something that isn't like a tower kind of shape, but Janae, I might do something a bit more like Berg's on this on this map. Berg's is pretty amazing, where the water comes down and just pushes it all to the middle on either side, and that that's a pretty cool cool looking thing. Um. I won't press that, it's not all grown and I don't need the bread anyway. Um, yeah, all my chests here, crazy amount of chests. And yeah, I've got, I've still got my sand machine actually, I went down here and uh, oh, still got the slimes as well, brilliant. My favourite. Got the noisy chickens, there aren't actually too many in there at the moment. Um, 
But yeah, I got my sand machine. I'm gonna miss this thing. I'm definitely, you know, gonna have to. I don't actually know if this thing works anymore because we're on 1.4.5. I think I may have tested it and it did. What, why can't I hit this thing? What the hell? But yeah, I'm um, gonna make one of them as well. I don't know about the chicken farm. I don't think I'll recreate anything like that. Um, if we start a new map soon, then I'll probably try and find a place that does actually have animals. Um, maybe not, you know, not water surrounding it, although I do quite like the water. But I think I should try something different. Um, I'm not really sure what yet. There's a lot of eggs down there, I don't really need those things. Uh, let's head out and... Oh! I've got a little visitor. Who wants to say goodbye? Do I have a bow anywhere? No, probably not. Hmm. Let's go take care of him. What have I even got here? Sharpness free looting one or two, where that was. Let's go kill this guy. Hiya! Oh, and he blows up. Oh, what's down here? Okay, so I have a little random cave there. Fair enough. Might as well just, you know, dig that up a bit. Put that there. <laughs> That's fine, just leave that. Doesn't really matter. Um, Kind of tempted that if, you know, it's definite that we're gonna get rid of this map, maybe. Could blow it all up. <laughs> Could be quite fun. Don't know, I kind of don't really want to. It's been kind of a cool place to no build. Wow, it looks really big since I don't have like, yeah, I'm missing like, like a ton of floors. Oh wow, that's a bit crazy. Looking up and I remember when this was kind of like all empty. It was like crazy big. And this thing t did take me absolutely forever to dig out. So kind of a bit bummed about that, but uh, I did all of that work. But uh, you know, that's that's onto Minecraft. You know, you start a new world and what happens. Um, oh, I've got a few things in here. I definitely want to take those. I might take some nether warts. I want to kind of take things that I can maybe grow. Uh, so I'm definitely going to... put some coal in there. But yeah, um, I'm going to have to speak to Gio about, you know, moving stuff over. I don't know if that'll happen, especially as the nether isn't there, so we can't all get our stuff to one place currently. Um, but yeah, I mean, this is only going to be a short little video. I don't really have much to do like it's back to the time where like things were spawning up in these corners. Look at him. I'm gonna where's a where's a where's a bow? I'm gonna snipe him off there for once. I don't have any arrows. That's not good. Oh, look. One thing I forget is arrows when I want to snipe someone off. Ooh, crescent moon. Um, yeah. And actually, that reminds me. Right. I'm gonna maybe kind of record this all in one because you know why not? Why as well? Um. I'm gonna head through here, and yeah, this is looking a bit different than it was, you know, I think I did this wall or something, didn't I? I can't remember where I got to, but uh, yeah, this is kind of where my secret base was, um, there's a door there that should open, maybe not, sometimes it doesn't, um, and I don't think that actually leads to the room at the end yet, but uh, Anyway, I'm kind of thinking that I might show you guys my little secret project since, you know, it's got, you know, well, it's not really finished anymore. Um, it was finished, but uh, as it's a rollback kind of thing, it's not anymore. It's kind of half a track on either side. Um, I'm not really sure how far I got on each of them, but I think I might actually kind of do a bit of a cinematic, maybe have some music in the background or something, maybe even maybe explain what's going on, I don't know yet. But uh, I think I'm going to take a ride on the minecart and uh, show you guys what I've been working on. So, I uh, think I'm going to go for a little ride and yeah, pretty much I'll just kind of explain to you quickly I suppose what I thought of, uh, this is the right way isn't it, way in, yeah, oh, this is the way out, kind of, oh, no entry there, yeah. But uh, yeah, I'm going to press this button and show you my kind of little secret project which I'm kind of a bit worried about shooting you because it isn't, it wasn't done, it, it wasn't done on this time uh, in October so yeah I don't know if there's any track missing either, I'm gonna just go for it and I uh, hope that this works, yep yeah, that works pretty well. So yeah pretty much I was trying for the whole having kind of different biomey things so there was a little um, cave with vines, this is a coal cavern, there was a sign back there, this, this is extremely glitchy right now. Um, Wow, that's a bit crazy. 
yeah, this is coal caverns, so yeah, there's a lot of coal everywhere. There's a drop here, um, we make a glitchy minecart, so I'm going to look up because that's, that's like weird. Um, goes along here, there's a bit of lava there, um, wow, yeah, get that cart out of the screen. That's a bit strange. Um, yeah, and then it was pretty much going to go around here. I don't think I actually put any, no, I didn't put any booster rails here. Of course I didn't. Um, so what I did after that, since it's not here anymore, I had kind of a snow biome. I blew this up a little bit on either side, a uh, path going along here, and it was pretty much a snow biome. And I blocked in kind of a load of snow golems. I was going to make it a bit bigger and put some um, uh, pine trees or whatever trees they are in the snow biomes, the spruce wood uh, trees. I was going to put some of those around, and yeah, I can't actually, I swear I like made like a hole back to the the room but obviously not so uh actually yes here okay so this does actually lead back to the main room which isn't finished at all um here it is and yeah this is how much is done of it um in october not a lot at all i completely got rid of this bridge thing and uh, this is the time when i actually had this bridge uh, I dug it back a bit, didn't I, as well? Not Maybe not back, but I definitely dig it, uh, dug it up a little higher. Um, you've probably got water dripping from the ceiling here, but I definitely made that a lot higher. Um, yeah, and I had that, I had like a, a design over here with the lava going up. And I started, the, you know, doing kind of walls and everything. But yeah, anyway, I'm going to probably, I don't know if this, I think this might need a booster rail. Actually, wait, this doesn't have a rail at all. Okay, so that's not great. Um, yeah, so I'm going to dig through, uh, I don't have any rail on me, I might have some in there, and if I do I'll do that, but uh, yeah, I'm just going to quickly make a little hole back to the way out and uh, show you that one as well. Okay, so I finally dug a way back in, and uh, someone's actually joined me in the server, Rando Dom, he's uh, kind of collecting stuff together as well, hopefully uh, being able to take our stuff with us a little bit, because he's got a ton of obsidian he wants to take because it's going to take him forever to dig that up on a new server, so yeah, definitely worth taking. Um, yeah, so I've dug a kind of a hole, um, this obviously wouldn't have been like this, I uh, can't remember actually what I had like this, um, okay, um, is something about something, um, yeah, so I had a spawner, oh, it was a slow move ground, yeah, in a swamp, because they should be in swamps. Uh, okay, so yeah, I had this spider spawner here. Um, oh, is that spawn? Okay, fair enough. Bit strange. Um, so yeah, I had the spider spawner here, which uh, the the trek I remember did actually go straight across here um, from over there, and I had kind of cages around this because I have this spider spawner here. I have that zombie spawner there. They're not close enough to kind of make a like a mob trap kind of thing or spawner. Actually, these two are. I could have done something with that, but I'm not really technical. I mean, I, ooh, I actually have a music disc in there. I'm going to take those with me. It's nice. I was actually going to leave them in there just because you know I didn't need them at the time, but I'm, I'm taking all the iron I can get. There's some there. I might come back for that. But yeah, I had those, and then this is pretty much where the track starts. So I haven't got any powered rails on these yet, so they're not going to work. But yeah, there's a spider spawn on there as well. Uh, See, so yeah, I can only have, like, I think I can only have two at the time running of those anyway. Um. So I got a spider spawn on there, and actually I did did actually change this, it does go straight back down there. But I had a track that came all the way around here, because if I come down here, there's actually another zombie spawner, so there's quite a lot of spawners in this area. Um, which I didn't realise they were all so close together, but um, also a lot of slimes. So yeah, I was kind of leaving up the spider webs, so I kind of got this kind of nice feel. And this is actually a real kind of mine shaft as well, uh, I didn't want to make my own, I wanted to use one that was already there. Um, and yeah, I think if I get on here and do this, and hopefully slimes don't get in the way. Yeah, so I put a tree there, uh, a tree, a uh, house there, and was gonna have it like a miner's kind of house with TNT and stuff next to it. Um, this pretty much goes all the way through. Um, it does go through a ravine at some point. I think this is a ravine, maybe. No, this. Oh, but here's a ravine. Yeah. Um, and then I kind of go through this little area here. Um, it's gonna be a little bit laggy, but um. Yeah, it's pretty much filled with water, and there's kind of two little kind of fort areas. I'm not sure if this is going to work, so I didn't check if they were filled with. Uh, let's see if this works. 
Okay, yeah, that, well, that worked. That worked. So I had I set them up a bit better actually. But um, yeah, they shoot fire at each other and, and shoot the vines and make them set fire to each other, which is kind of cool. It was a bit of a pain to work out. But yeah, I then made a village here, which is what I was doing with the villagers, as I didn't tell you last time. But I've named all the houses after people on the server. Well, I did. Um, I'm also missing a block there. So um, oh. Oh, I've lost it. Okay, good thing I bought another one. Uh, let's get over here. And actually, I think I'm going to run the rest of the way because it's so. Um, <laughs> I've no idea what Rand is on about. Fair enough. Um, yeah, zombie spawner there, which actually I accidentally got rid of um, before because there's a weird glitch. I don't think there might. Uh, no, it's 1.4.5 now, so it might not be there anymore. But, uh,. Yeah, I also have vill I had villagers in there, and a villager in here, and then the zombie spawner. And if I go down here, which you don't actually see if you go along the track, but there's a little kind of uh, area here, which did actually have a... I also had like a little villager in it as well, um, which I thought was kind of cool. Then you get past this, which is actually where the other... Yes, yeah, that's actually the other track, and um, the way in. So you do kind of... I was going to have it like you could see kind of the other track a bit more, but... And I didn't really do that. And as this is the way back, you don't really see this area here very well. Um, since you're facing this way, but if I turn around, you know, there's some chickens in here. Um, there are some chickens in here. And yeah, just kind of wanted it as like a little green, grassy area. Um, and yeah, this is pretty much it. So I did a bit more. I, I did well. I did quite a lot more work uh, on those. I did actually this area as well, didn't I? Um, so there's actually quite a lot missing, but yeah, that's pretty much what my secret project was. It was kind of doing this, and if you remember from the last uh, video, it would have been. Um, I did actually move my nether portal that way, so this is actually going to be a way to and from my base, um, uh, from or into my base from from there, as well as having this tunnel as well when people have, because you know you only want to really ride this to and from once really, you don't want to have to ride it over and over again unless you really kind of liked it I suppose um, but yeah that's pretty much it pretty much it for for this little area um, yeah not much else to re say about that other than that was my secret project and yeah it'd be kind of cool to you know <laughs> yeah I've worked then um, to kind of get your feedback on that because that's kind of something that I don't know if I want to build the same kind of thing next time. I kind of, I kind of like it. It's kind of, I suppose, like a roller coaster in Minecraft, but, but not. It's not like kind of, you know, crazy kind of. Because when you make a roller coaster in Minecraft, it's kind of got all twists and turns and everything. It's a bit crazy, you know. Your mouse doesn't like stay in the same place. Uh, you end up looking at the sky or something because your mouse like goes whoop, like that, and yeah, it's just weird. You can't like. You, it's not the same feeling as you get with a roller coaster in real life. So. With that, I kind of wanted to make it kind of more of a, not really a story, I should have actually done a story from the beginning, which I might do next time, that'd be kind of cool, um, and time it a bit better, because I definitely, you know, just kind of put loads of powered rails down and everything, um, definitely tried to, you know, fix some of the timing so that, you know, you go through places a bit, a bit slower, but that's all kind of a bit, uh, a pain to try and do, but, um, yeah, I, we're going to have rules here as well, um, what kind of things to, you know, not do, like, don't go on this line and stuff, um, and it's going to just be like that. But I, I, I realised that people are going to get me coming from that way, because that's when I decided that I was going to have a nether pool on that side, so, yeah, I needed to add those on the other side, uh, but obviously never got around for that. Anyway, I think that's enough of that area, um, I don't really have much else to say, other than, you know, I'm going to get loads of stuff in a chest, and hopefully be able to, you know, get it all in a new world and hopefully see you guys in that new world as well. Uh, I hope you kind of carry on watching. I'm really looking forward to starting a new world actually. Uh, I was a bit, you know, annoyed at first and, you know, um, at the, obviously the person that hacked, you know, and obviously got rid of the, the map and the, the server host and everything. Um, but yeah, I mean, now I'm not, you know, it happened and yeah, we're just going to have to kind of get on with it and, you know, start a new world, which is kind of exciting. I know a lot of people actually did want to start a new world anyway, um, but then you've got people like myself that have been starting big projects, because I know Doc Redstone had a big project going, he was building, like, a castle thing. Uh, I think someone else might have been building a castle, and then you've got Mumbo Jumbo, who's, like, doing a town, and, like, his old, old like, donators thing, he's going to, like, lose all that. 
and I have to rebuild all that stuff. Uh, he did like an amazing nether tunnel as well in his episode, which is kind of cool. Um, who else? There's kind of lo loads of pe things people are doing. Sark was like kind of doing like things with the spawn and the nether hub and everything, and that's like completely gone. So yeah, it's kind of a bit annoying for everyone involved, really. Um, but yeah, uh, I hope we can kind of take some stuff over. You know, at least one chest, double, at least one double chest would be kind of cool. Um, but yeah, I've got one question for you guys, and that is pretty much just uh, what do you want to see in the next in the, the new world? Uh, what do you want to see me build? I mean, this base is obviously you know underwater, not but not by under too much water really, but. Uh, yeah, I kind of don't really want to do a water space again. Uh, having to dig all this out, kind of. Yeah, I think that was enough for me. I don't want to have to do that again. I'm going to grab an pill from here and go up. I kind of want to do something a bit different. So it'd be kind of cool to get your your kind of feedback in what kind of base we should do. Do you want to do something in the sky? I kind of think that's been done quite a lot. I don't know, maybe something different in, different in the sky. I don't want to do like a sky castle or anything. That's kind of done quite a lot. Um, maybe just something on kind of like a nice bit of land, you know, kind of like a village, maybe kind of build lots of different style things. I don't know. It's, it's, I'm gonna leave it up to you guys and kind of see what you think, and you know, kind of hope you probably have better ideas than me. I, d I kind of a bit stuck at what I will do in the new world. Um, not sure when it'll be either, so it might be a while till you see a next GMAN episode. Also, thinking I should name it a bit differently. The episode. Um, I was thinking GMI in like respawned or I don't know something like that. Something kind of catchy, maybe. I don't know. I might just call it GMI and then like episode one and do, do the same thing again. But uh, maybe GMI 2.0 might be kind of cool. It's kind of a cool name. No, I might call it that. Um, but yeah, let's like, just you know leave ideas in the comments, guys. Uh, that'd be great. And uh, yeah, this has pretty much been my base. Uh, it's all down there. All my hard work is down there. And yeah, I don't know. I'll you know play around on this a little bit longer. You know, chat to Rando a bit more. And yeah, this has pretty much been it. Yeah, uh, the base has been really awesome. Kind of a shame that I didn't get to finish it. Would love to have finished the base for once because I don't think I've actually ever done that. Be kind of cool if I could do that. Well, like you know, not finish it completely because there's always stuff to add, but. Yeah, it didn't really get to you know a good like finishing stage, um, especially now as it hasn't even got flaws. Um, but yeah, thank you for watching, guys, and thank you for all your support. Like the Geo episodes, I know they're my kind of more popular episodes of things. Um, so yeah, that will definitely back be back kind of soon, I hope. And I'm really looking forward to it. So thank you for watching, and I'll catch you next time. Bye.